For Action News, I'm Anna Samovska. Do arrows pointing to fresh produce sections while you shop nudge you to buy more fruits and veggies? Or does looking at yourself in the mirror while you shop help you pick healthier foods? Well, some scientists seem to think so. The strategy is called nudge marketing. In the presence of arrows, consumers were more likely to follow the signs leading to fresh produce. Another tactic involved attaching a mirror to the front of the shopping cart so consumers could see themselves shopping. Researchers divided the cart into two sections, one for fruits and veggies and the other for other items. They found average produce sales increased from four to about nine dollars per customer. That nudge marketing though doesn't stop there. Some of the sweetest items on the shelves are eye level for good reason. Shoppers attention remains there the longest. Associate Director of Public Health Ariel Sabransky had this perspective. So, I mean, there's a lot of cues in supermarkets that kind of nudge people to spend more time in certain sections or to buy certain products. Um, they place a lot of the, the sugary products at eye level so that people spend more time looking at them. Um, they put certain products by the cash register, so, you know, impulse buys. Um, but this is really the first time that they're using these social type cues to nudge people to go towards the produce section and I think that um, that if they can get people to spend more time in that section this has the potential to be a huge game changer and to really encourage people to buy more fruits and vegetables. Um, I think it's also interesting a lot of the cues that they use in the study kind of make more people more aware of themselves so it's like they're consciously making the decision to buy more fruits and vegetables and I think that also has the potential to create more long-lasting behavioral changes. And we've all been there, those impulse items at the checkout lane get me every time. And to read more on this story and others, head to our website, aksha.org. Don't forget you can sign up for your daily newsletter delivered right to your inbox right there on the website. For Aksha, I'm Anna Samovska.